Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, baby, um, and gals. I, it's implied. Um, anyway, I'm glad you guys came back, and uh, I uh, had released a video earlier today. It's not this one, but uh, that was uh, if you hear the music, you couldn't hear my voice, so I redid that one. I got everything hopefully set up to not do that again, and we're going to go back into it and see what. Uh, what everything looks like. What I wanted to say too was, um, um, what are we doing? We're doing a Hallelujah, which I've done a million times. The Jeff Peckley version, not the, uh, not necessarily the uh, version. Uh, Cohen wrote this a long, long time ago. Um, and we're going to do uh, Tori Kelly, who I do not know at all. I don't think I do anyway. And then we're going to do uh, a group of girls that I've just really gotten to know. Um, and they're from the Philippines. They're called Fourth Impact, and they're a group of sisters, if I'm not mistaken. And man, they can bring it, no question. I have not heard them do this song, but I have no no uh, doubt that they'll be able to to present this song the way they'll present everything else. Now, the Tori um, Kelly version is very short, so I wonder how there's a lot of verses to the song. Uh, there's a lot more verses, I believe, than. Uh, the other band, the greatest, I'm sorry, the fourth impact is going to bring it as well. So let's get started in this and just see how how they interpret it, how they bring it to us. All right, let's see. Look at my hair. Look at this. Better. The stupid hair. All right. Here we go, guys. Thank you for your patience. This is Tori Kelly. I heard there was a secret chord that David played, and it pleased the Lord. But you don't really care for music, do you? But it goes like this, the fourth, the fifth, the minor fall and the major lift, the baffled king composing hallelujah, 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 hallelujah. I told the truth, I didn't come to fool ya And even though it all went wrong I'll stand before the Lord of song With nothing on my tongue But hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah Um, what to say about it? First of all, to say, um, um, oh, 
guys, I'm sorry. I don't know what's up here. Here we go. Um, to say that um, is that the reason, well, the reason it was less than three minutes long, I should only sing two verses, right? Which is fine. It's really all I needed, to be honest with you. Um, no offense to uh, Larry Cohen for writing so long. And he had to say, said what he had to say, but the very first verse and the very last verse for me was the key, which talks about um, standing before the Lord of Song. And I'm, I have a uh, something in my uh, lozenge because of my throat. Anyway, um, standing before the, the the Lord of Song, and all I have is, is my voice, sing a song to you and give you hallelujahs. Man, that struck me like you don't can't believe. And in the beginning, the acoustic guitar and her, that's all I needed. It was great. Now, do I like it full band? If you watch my other videos, of course I do. And you know that I do. Um, I like orchestras. I like bands. I like punk rock. I like everything you can imagine for the most part. But there's something to be said for guitar, vocals and guitar. That's it. The simplicity of it. And yet the, the uh, the ability to create such dynamics in such simple uh, instruments, right? Wow, so good. She has an amazing voice. Her range was amazing. Yeah, if this was live, whoever produced it back at the board did an amazing job. Because I had no idea. I thought for sure if it was a studio thing. And I still think it was, but it, it possibly not. Um, let's go on to the other one and see what uh, we think about now this is going to be fully produced because that's the way they do their music. This is we're going to go back and do um, fourth impact. Here we go. And these girls are burning it up right now, burning it up, and for right reason. They look like they're probably in their uh, rehearsal room or maybe backstage or something working on the song. And uh, again, as a wannabe producer. Um, and as um, a musician, listen to the end of this song for the harmonies that they do. And they do some sliding between harmonies. And you'll see what I mean. And if not, I'll explain it afterwards. But, uh, you, but also on the song, you could tell that they're sisters for sure because of the timbers of each other. They sing a song, they sing their solos differently. But if you listen, you could tell they're, they're related. All right, here we go. Stay ready. One, two, three, and.
say this about let me get this off here uh, let me say about how um i apologize i did not uh that was not the the uh, original video i thought it was that i had responded to uh when i first did the very first one but i left it on here for a couple reasons um at first i was just gonna stop and redo it again uh but i thought you know it's nice to hear them as live as I have, right? I have not heard that. Uh, first of all, I thought the production uh, was poor in the sense that you could hear the voices, but it was saturated with reverb. I don't know why. I don't know what, why they chose that. It looked like, again, it was either in, uh, in behind the stages, about to go on, maybe it's at their home. I have no idea. Uh, the production work on, on this wasn't as good as the first one that I picked out. Also, the, the cool really sliding harmonies that they did on uh, the first one i know you're confused because they weren't on the second one they weren't there and they truncated the song a little bit um but it does not take that doesn't take away anything from uh, from their vote their vocals are amazing and their harmonies are amazing i i i was hearing more in the other video but what they sang was outstanding and again they sound like one voice and one thing I didn't say about about uh, them in the last video that I've just thought of now is uh, I don't remember who the group was, but they went out to record them. I don't know any of the backstory, so don't hold me to this, except what I had heard was that they recorded this vocal group doing acapella, acapella. And when they, um, when they harmonized, to a note and they sent it through an analyzer, they couldn't tell there was more than one person seeing it. It sounded like to the machine, to the AI or computer, it sounded like you could not pull apart each separate harmony because they were so entangled, it sounded like one, four parts in one person. And that's how I feel about them. Is when they do sing, and I would urge you to, I'm not gonna go back and, and get it and do it again, but if you, I would urge you to look up them live if you haven't heard them already or even if you have uh and you're and you and you're just enamored by the girls or whatever stop and really just close your eyes and really listen to uh their harmonies their harmonies are amazingly done and uh and listen to that and then and, and what do you think about it tell me what you think about it um man i love it i think it's great uh i love Lauren already uh, i think she's great uh, and there's, there's something about the harmonies that get me every time and I know you do as well and I know now uh, if I did before how why you're so passionate about the group uh, the four came back anyway guys listen I love you and I enjoy this uh, despite a little, little bit of technical difficulties uh, give me a thumbs up if you liked it at all please um, on your way out give me a thumbs up that just thumbs up it just means you liked it um and to share with your friends for you and or if, share with your friends um and to point out that don't maybe share this one with them but share another one um share them the fourth one back make sure that you do um and uh subscribe subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and um what else 
I will hit the notification bell so you'll be alerted when I release more material. And uh, guys, thank you again so much for coming by. Comment down below, baby. Let me know what you think, but let me know what you'd like to see more of or less of or groups I haven't even heard of yet, like Fourth Impact. And until next time, love you, and I'll see you later.